will return in a moment. Oh boy, this has been a really exciting episode so far. I wonder who's gonna win Top Ninja Grill Out. I don't know, but my money's on Sancho. Please, Sancho's sauce skills are pretty weak, whereas Han, he's got a good shot. Han, no way, man. Wait, what is this? Hello, I am Napoleon Bonaparte, and are you tired of not having a French president? I know I am, we. Oui. Well, vote for me, eh? I am Napoleon Bonaparte. What is my platform? My platform is being good. Yes, I'll make everything good. And, yes. Hey, wh why would you vote for Spider-Man, eh? What's he gonna do for you? No. And also, George Washington is an idiot. Why would you vote for him as well? What, do you think the man that has the one dollar bill, you know, he's gonna be great? No! He's barely, you know, been in this country very long, you know, he was just there in the beginning and now he's here again and stuff, so, so, you gonna vote for him? No, you gonna vote for Napoleon Bonaparte, you know it. Also, George Washington, if you are watching this, you smell like Rotten Ham. The nerve of some people. Well, actually, he's kind of right, you kind of smell like Rotten Ham. Oh, oh, sorry, but, oh, well, how dare he make that little commercial ad thingy mabob? is that even legal? Of course it is, people do it all the time, you know, they smear each other. Say, if he's got a commercial, then maybe we need a commercial too. Oh, if we're making a commercial, can it be about my combination blender forklift? What? No! Alright, well, if we're making a commercial, we need a director. Well, I mean, I could direct. I am the brilliant Benjamin Franklin. How hard could directing be? Ben, why is everything on fire? Oh, don't worry, it's just part of the set. Ben! Huh, who would have thought? Directing is actually kind of hard. Okay, well, uh, maybe we need a professional director. Actually, guys, I think I know the man for the job. Here he is, Stanley Kubrick. Wait, what's going on with his head, man? No, don't talk about his head, man. It's Stanley Kubrick. What else do you expect him to look like? Hello, guys. What's up? Oh, hey, uh, hey, Mr. Kubrick. You remember me? Yes, yes, I do. So, why do you want me here? Exactly. My time is money. And where's the money? Well, Mr. Kubrick, I'm running for president, and I was wondering if you could make a campaign ad for me. Yes, I think that'd be pretty cool. I'm running against Napoleon Bonaparte. Napoleon Bonaparte? I wanted to make a Napoleon movie once, but it never got made. So yes, I'll make a campaign ad for you. Looks like I'm making a George Washington movie. Let's do this. Alright George, are you ready for your big moments? Oh yes, yes I am, but uh, why am I holding the shovel? Isn't it obvious it's a symbol? Anyways, so let's take it from the top, shall we? Are you sure this is gonna work? I mean, this doesn't seem like the, the best way to start a campaign ad. No, 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 don't worry, this worked in the 80s, let's do it. Okay. <clears throat> Here's Georgie. How was that, Mr. Kubrick? That was pretty good, except for the fact that it's completely unusable. Try again. Here's Georgie. Did you forget how to act? Say it like you actually know how to act. Again. Here's Georgie. That was much better, much better. We're gonna need more takes of that. Again. Here's... Georgie. Alright, alright, that's it, that's it. I think that first sick will work, but we've got a bunch of other ones just in case. Alright, let's move on to the next shot. Uh, what's going on over here? Art, George, art. This is how we start the campaign right here, the campaign ad. See? It's a metaphor. Alright. And, action. Oink, oink. Oink. Oink, oink, oink. 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 Oink, 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 oink. Oink. That brings a tear to my eye every time. Alright, next scene. Alright, George, ready for this next scene? Wait, who's this guy? That's you, but young. Alright, you just look at them, you, you look at your young self, then you turn towards me, alright? You got it? Uh, okay.
Wait, why is everything in black and white now? You're a war hero, George. You gotta act like it. Oh, come on. Black and white is the perfect way to shoot a war movie. Now, do it. Do your thing. Uh, okay. Bang. Bang, 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 bang. Very good, very good. Let's do seven more takes of that. In fact, actually, let's do 59 more takes. I think that's a better number. Yeah. Uh, this ad campaign's kind of weird, right? I mean, all the things we shot for the commercial right now are kind of abnormal. Yeah, I think we should have gone with Spielberg on this one. All right, guys. It's done. It's all edited meticulously and to perfection. Take a look. Before George Washington, America was nothing but fields where realistic pigs ate their grass. Oink, oink. But then one man stood up and changed America forever. Here's Georgie. He fought in combat, single-handedly defeating the British Army. And now, he is running for president. Hey, I'm George Washington and I'm running for president. Wow, that was really good actually, I liked that a lot. Thank you, thank you, everything in there is true. All facts in that commercial. Oh uh, yes, yes, but I do have a question though, what does that final shot mean exactly? People will be talking about that for decades, so I don't even know what it means. Well thanks again for the help Mr. Kubrick, do we owe you anything? No, no, just make sure that thing gets seen by a lot of people. You got it sir, you got it. 